Welcome back guys. Um, so I got the um, Dame Darcy Mermaid Tarot and I thought I would do a side by side comparison because I got the first edition and then I cannot remember what edition this is. I don't know if it's second or third but it's the one with the golden gilded golded the gold gilded edges um so i know that if you go to her etsy shop it's available now so whatever edition that one is available now that is what this is um and it's really cute because it comes in this little gorgeous little box um and when i open the package um there were these little like gem like buried treasure things in the box and I'm just like that is so cute um that was a cute little surprise and um yeah so this one comes in a box now um whereas the first edition I think it just came plastic wrapped and in another plastic bit and um but the box is really nice and inside is just um so that's the inside. These are just two extra cards that you get. Um, and it's good that it comes in a box now. But yeah, that was so cute. I was so happy when I saw that. It's like, oh, a little buried treasure. Sea chest treasure thing. Okay, so let's just pop them over there. Huh? And I'm just going to kind of flip them through. So as you can see... Um, the deck is quite, the new deck is quite thicker and as I said it's got the gold lining on the edges so, and the cardstock is different so this one's more um, like bendy, still good cardstock, like I do like the cardstock of the first one and this one's your, the soft matte finish that we all love not quite as bendy but still beautiful buttery soft matte okay so I'm just gonna kind of go through and just kind of do the comparison comparison like that and there are quite a few changes actually even though majority of the cards still look the same she did go through and change quite a bit so but I'm glad she kept the king of swords because I like I like him and the queen as well she's very like dragon lady ish and she reminds me of a few people that I know and it's I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing so this one is a change hopefully you can see the color difference as well <clears throat> And it's funny because in the old, in the new deck, some of the colours look more saturated than the old, than the first edition. But then in the first edition, some of the cards look, in the new edition, some of the cards look more um, saturated, like the colours. But I love the Dame Darcy deck. I use it for myself I use it for other people love it as well um, so this one sticks to the more traditional Rider weight the eight of swords did you just hear those people yelling I did hopefully that didn't come through in the camera but he was pretty rude and loud. That's the same. Yeah, I just... And it's so accurate. And it just reads really well. I love this... I love the Dame Darcy deck. And I love her style of artwork. Um, she's just so clever how she's done the Mermaid Tarot. Is it called the Dame Darcy deck or the Mermaid Tarot? I wonder what name it goes by. So 
So a big change with the aces. And you know what? I don't like one or the other. It's, you know. Hold on. Aces. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're starting with the kings. Yeah. I just had a moment there. Sorry. Yeah, I don't like. I like this deck for its art, and I like this deck for its art and style as well. So I just really love them both. I think if you like the Dame Darcy deck, you like the third edition. I don't know if you can actually get the first edition anymore. I'm not too sure. But yeah, I love her style of art. And the changes I find are, are good changes. See, like this one looks more colour saturated than this one. So nine of cups. it looks like um like so you see how you got this mermaid girl here it looks like this is more of a close-up of this girl but I, I don't know if she designed it that way or if it's just what she did but um yeah it looks like it's a close-up but even though I know the body gestures are different I don't know And the new edition has that little border. So does the old edition, but it's a very thin border, whereas this one has more of a border. But it doesn't, um, that doesn't bother me. Two of cups. Um, I find the Dame Darcy Tarot is good for um, people who want to still want to stick with a traditional Rider weight, but want to kind of branch out from the traditional images and work with something different, but still sticking to the theme. I'm so happy that there's seahorses in here. Both the first edition is beautiful and the new gold edition is beautiful. So yes, if you like nautical theme decks as well and mermaids, I mean, I love all that. always have pretty hair I think all the aces have changed by the looks of it 
I like this King of Wands as well. The first edition is more slippery, though, I've noticed. because matte, the matte finish isn't as slippery. Oh yes, by the way, this is a full flip through, so if you want to skip ahead, you can if you don't want to see all the cards. But yeah, this deck is very accurate with me when I do readings for myself and accurate when I read for other people. And it's just a, an easy deck to pick up and just dive right in. It doesn't come... With a book, it can't. I think you have to go on the website, or it, there's instructions in here about how to get the guidebook. So this one was, I'm just looking, 2012. So I've had this for a few years. It's getting out of control. Okay. Right, so that should get me through. We're on the home run now, guys. So, I love this moon card and I love this moon card. Like I said, the changes are, I like them. And just because it's nautical themed doesn't mean it um, doesn't change on how the messages come across. There's dolphins. It just makes me happy, this deck. But like I said, it's it's very accurate as well.
Priestess is the same. Oh, I can't pick up the car. Ew. Magician. And the Fool. Alrighty, guys. Looks like we have come to an end. So, I don't know if you want to see me shuffle the cards. But this one, this one has always shuffled really smooth. So it is beautiful. But the matte, you know, if you love the matte finish, that shuffles as well. It is, like I said, a bit chunkier, but... And I have to shuffle, like, vertically because my hands are fat and short, but it still shuffles really well. And I'll pull a card. Pull a card, then I'll finish the video. Okay. So let me break it up and we'll see what we get. The Two of Cups. Aww. I think me and this deck are going to be very happy together. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Bye!